Hey everybody, we are at Crawford Castle. Now this has got to be the first video of an investigation series of Castles of Scotland with Ghost Squad of Scotland. My friend Alan is here with me, so he's got to be doing some of the filming eh, at the location with me telling you some of the history. But let me show you around about this place. This is absolutely fantastic. Now let's go up to the location. Now hopefully this video will be about maybe half an hour long. I will take you into the castle itself. Look at that guys, that's stunning. Now this is quite a haunted castle, what I've been told. It's on Google Maps, you can look it up. It will give you the exact location of the area. That's the house that uh, it belongs to the estate that owns this but it's no more i don't think they own this anymore but that was part of the castle when this fell into ruin that house was built for the lord or the laird as you can see we're in quite a beautiful spot as you can see i'll give you a pan round here you've got the hills over there Absolutely stunning location. Now we'll need to navigate ourselves through the, the, the stinging nettles, Alan. Which shall way will we go? You know, this is where, to be thankful, you don't have shorts on. As you can see, there is a roadway close by. Watch out for the Scottish thistles there. Um, there is livestock in this field, so if you're bringing your dogs or bringing any animals with you, like dogs or, well, dogs obviously, um, there is livestock, so please keep your dogs on the lead at all times. It's a beautiful location, isn't it, Alan? Quite steep, this hill. Don't worry, guys. If I fall, I'll land on top of Alan. Oh, good. <laughs> now, guys, we're going to be going to a lot of different locations around Scotland. Um, we've got Burkwood uh, Castle in Les Mahego, which was a hospital and is sadly falling into decay. Uh, we've got lots of locations, but look at this, guys. Let me get some close up. Now, the video will cut out a couple of times. Here we are ladies and gentlemen at Crawford John Chapel. Now I thought I'd bring you in here because I would like to show you the war memorial. Now obviously we were at um, Crawford Castle just a couple of hours ago. Well, for you it's a couple of milliseconds ago but for us it was about an hour ago. But um, let me take you up here. Crawford John Cemetery. Here we go. Now there was a can you museum area in there we can uh, look at. Was that a plough, Alan? Oh, it definitely is a plough. Um, there will be photos that will show. But this is quite interesting. This, I don't actually know that much about this church, to be honest with you guys. I don't know when this church was built. There we go. Zoom out a little bit, make it a wee bit easier for these. The Great War. I'll get both sides for these all.
look at that guys it's lying flat now there's nothing on this side well there's more at this side Now, will we go clockwise round about the property? Alan? Right, definitely. Let's take you along here, guys. Now, you shouldn't get the dead cat light before down. I've put it up a wee bit, so... It's always a learning experience, guys, with this new technology. Now, we can probably tell about when this place was built. I'm betting this place was maybe built... In the, what do you think, Alan? 13th century, 12th, 13th, 14th century? Look at that, can you imagine how much that weighs? That's... You know, I'm born only about three or four miles from this location and I never in my life have I been in here. Look at that. Can't even make it out. Is that there? There's... Um... Now the newer bits can be down the bottom. I don't think they bury anybody in here anymore, do they, Alan? When was the last time do you think they buried someone in here? They do. There's a new bit down there. I'm going to stay out of the new bit, guys, because I'm, I don't like going round about a newer part of a cemetery, so I'm just going to stay in the older part, okay? Because I see there's a fresh burial down there, so out of remark to respect, I'm, I'm not going to go down there. So... I'm more here for the building, the location itself. This has always fascinated me, guys, and it's the same in Greyfriars Graveyard, which I'll be going soon to. Uh, how you get these big stone... This is like a gravestone, isn't it, Alan? Uh, yes. What, has this not got a name? Is there no a name for this? Or maybe in the, uh, the bottom, guys, leave what these are called. They're like tombstones. Mm -hmm. But as you can see, there's nothing underneath, it's just dirt. Yep. You know? But remember guys, just pause. If you... Okay. Now, look at that. That's a big stone. That's stunning, guys. Can you think how long that took to carve? Up that way is Lead Hills, one of the highest days. Uh, Warnock Head's the highest uh, village in Scotland. Yes, yes. We'll take you up there soon too, guys. It's a shame I couldn't do Mori Crawford Castle because it was just so overgrown with weeds. But we'll go back in the winter time. Look at those beautiful headstones down there. We'll need to go down there. That's stunning. This is an absolutely stunning church, this. There is a tomb. See that? I bet you. Yeah. I bet that's a tomb. This is absolute stun. The church. Now we'll be going to Sanker Castle soon, which is down that road there, about 15 miles down that road. Look at that, it must be getting renovated. renovated. Well, we'll go down here for a little looky. <clears throat> if I fall down a hole, I'm sure Alan will rescue me. No. <laughs> Do you hear that guys, he says he's not going to rescue me, that's, that's terrible, you know. <laughs> we'll be going to Lanark Graveyard too soon, so that should be interesting. Well, that will be fun. Look at that, guys. There's a skull. This place must be older than I think it is. I think it must go back to at least the 12th century. Look at that skull there, guys. Can I 
move out the way a bit, the light in there so as you can actually see it. Look at that. Now obviously we will be coming back with the team for a night time investigation of this area. Um, so that will be interesting. That's a stunning gravestone. I mean that would have cost a lot. That would have cost a lot when it was done. See he carved that. That's stunning. And, uh, the newer bit's further down but I'm not going near the, the newer area. What's this here? Watch the hole there, Arnold. Look at me. There's like a hole here. This is interesting. It must be like a private. Oh dear, Jesus. There's a hole there. Mm -hmm. Go on, Alan. You want to say anything for the camera? No. See, he's my, he's my guinea pig for the team. You know, we're going to lock him in some tombs and stuff. <laughs> I'm only joking, guys. I'm only joking. Yeah, can look. They've, they've repaired that. With the bolts. Just remember, guys, just pause it so as you can read it. Try and get a good shot for these guys. Now, remember, if you like these videos, please give me a, a subscribe and a share and a like. It helps the channel grow. And the more subscribers and the more viewers I've got, the more videos that will come. Tail autumn is on the way here. The the weather here's changing. That's quite an old one. Overgrown. There's, oh, there's that tomb there, Alan. Mm -hmm. uh, let's have a look at this. There's um, 1879, 1931. 1966, age 71 years old, that must have been the last one of the family. This must be a tomb. Look at, that. Look at how time is drew through that stone, splitting it in half. It's amazing on this camera I can see the writing much better. See that? Oh. It's like on the camera I can see it so much better, but on this I can't see it that much. Mm -hmm. That's a tomb. See the the capping stone right. for the tomb. <coughs> now I'll come round here. Yeah, what's the date on that? 1766. Is it 1766? Uh -huh. What happened in 1766? Was that an American Revolution or? Thereabouts. Uh, yeah, was that? A year before it. Look at that, guys. I've got a lot of you history buffs that follow me, so you'll be able to tell me what happened in 1776. Was it 1766? Sorry. 1766. Well, look at this, guys. I'll need to do a. I can uh, remember. Just pause it guys, because I'm holding it up so as you can see this, because I can't see the camera. I'll watch it back myself. But anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed Crawford Castle. A very, very, very uh, Crawford Castle. And, and enjoyed, obviously, this amazing location we're in right now. Crawford John Chapel. I'm getting mixed up with the names there guys. You know, all with the same kind of name. Hey, look at that, there's. It's got the skull and crossbones. Now, there was a reason for that, was there no the skull and crossbones? Leave below, guys. Why was the reason that they put the skull and crossbones on tombstones? But as I say, the newer bat is down there straight ahead, but I'm going to stay out of there. As a mark, to, a mark of respect. I think he's been in there for a while. 
but this has been absolutely fantastic. You can feel the cold, can't you, Alan? There's another skull and crossbone. Not that much left yet. Here we'll take you up to the door of the church and you can maybe see if you're interested in this place. There's some pretty flowers at this time of the year. It's a very old kind of flower planter. Crawford Heritage Venture Museum. I did not know there was a museum here so I'll have to come back. I did not know that. Oh look at this Alan, we must miss this bit. Oh my look at that old place falling down. Okay, imagine living so close to the church. Might as well get it all. I'll stay out of that kind of area because obviously there's, there's gardens and there's people in them so anyway guys thank you for watching and uh, hopefully more videos coming soon oh shall we take them into the, the kind of museum area up the top here is that a way in i don't think is that a way in up the top there uh, it may be crusty, see guys see the longer i the longer videos i do it takes longer to upload so Look at the old oak tree. Is there any writing on the back of them? There's some writing on that one. There's another skull and crossbone. What's left there? Here we go, guys. There's the kind of picnic. Can they, what is that? It's like a picnic can they, monument area. Oh. There we go, it's like a nice wee area here. That's the modern part of the, the graveyard down the bottom. But anyway guys, I hope you have all had a fantastic day. There you go. Plough. I think that's meant to be like a a whale or something like that. That's right. You know, there's something you don't see much. Eh? There is something you don't you don't see much. Eh? And uh, look at that, curling stones. But anyway, guys, I'm going to leave you on this beautiful scene here. Have a great day. Subscribe, share, like, and more videos coming soon.